Hello everyone, in the past three episodes I've done literally nothing. All and spent like seven minutes trying to pick my name, and choosing Red Dell, and singing this horrible song. But my voice that song sounds beautiful, but anyway. Anyway, I just got an email from him, I'm not singing anymore. Saying at the time, saying at this time, it's real. It is intriguing, but we're busy with our Pokemon research. Wait. I know. Red Dev, can you go in our place? I, you didn't give me a choice. I want you to raise one of the Pokemon contained on these balls. Oh god. You'll be that Pokemon's first partner, Red Dev. Go on and pick one. Uh, choose this one. That rabbit from the Snack Professor Elm 8 is in there. So we got Chikorita. And it's Chikorita, the grass Pokemon. Thank you, look carefully. And Dex is a. Uh, Toto Dial is really cute. Do you want Toto Dial, the water Pokemon? Think it over carefully. Your partners, yeah, yeah. That's uh, Sandiquil, I think, yeah. Sandiquil! Oh, and he's cute. You'll take Sandiquil, the fire Pokemon. You know, I would do a poll on Twitter right now, but I'm currently. Recording this in my granddad's house, and I have no. Well, he has no internet. So I'm just gonna pick Sunnicle because I'm. Well, I'm Red Dev. So I might as well just pick Sunnicle because he's cute as fuck. So I just nod my head here, please, the song. I want to hurt my head. So I guess we'll take, um. Sunnicle with Fire Pokemon. In fact, that's a great Pokemon to you. Red Dev receives Sundaquil. Yay. Give it a nickname to the Sundaquil you received. Yes. Like, why is his name longer than mine? That's bull. My name is only seven spaces. He gets one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. He gets ten. Bullshit. I hate this game, it's off in my mouth. Oh. Now, I thought during the series I would name my Pokemon, the uh, Pokemon I've caught, named after my uh, followers on Twitter, so I thought I'd call this one. One second, so let me throw his name on. Yeah, I think I can. Probably tell the you as we watch this video. <sighs> Where is the There we go, Prince Joey, who I follow on Twitter, and he's a very nice guy. So there I have a Prince Joey. I know you're a red, a blue, alicorn, bat pony, bat pony, but not you're a fire type Sunderquill, so yeah. Okay, there we go, Prince Joey, you're my Sunderquill. That's him. But you hear the auto stop for a second, like the stop for a second. Mr. Pokemon loves. Loves a but <laughs> loves a little beyond cherry boo. The next update over is almost direct roots there, so you can't miss it. But just in case, here's my phone number. Call me if anything comes up. It was filthy. Well, that's a jingle. Red Dev got Elm's phone number. If your Pokemon is hurt, you should heal it with this machine. Feel free to use it anytime. 
Did anyone actually use that machine over there? Red Dead, I'm counting on you. Uh, do it. Red Dead, I want you to have this for your errand. Red Dead, receive potion. Red Dead, put the potion and the item back. There are only two of us, so we're always busy. And hire someone else. I got one potion that's gonna help. So now I can go. You let me go now. Oh, your Pokemon is adorable. I wish I had one and get one. Sorry, just a flashback there, just... I love this song so much. You gonna fight me? Oh, oh thank you, I'm fight you in this route. So, uh... Oh, wait, but I can't always just do this, like... Well, every single spot that I got attacked. Just a way to grind. Oh! G. Here comes Prince Joey. I said it well. Come on, tackle him. Tackle! Oh god. And he does it use tackle. Well, I'm not doing a Nuzlocke, by the way. Just too much pressure on the first playthrough. Because that's just far too hard for me, sorry. I've seen a lot of people do it and it seems kind of fun, but I like playing my games relatively, you know, relaxing. You know, this game's supposed to, supposed to be relaxed while playing the game. And I know people like doing speed runs, and I don't like that personally. I, I like to watch know, people do it, but I like enjoying my games while playing them. So taking them, what's going on and stuff, and just having fun really. I'm not saying that the, I'm not saying that speedrunners don't have fun playing their games. Of course they do, they love it. Like, yeah, that, Mario 64 guy, who put his name forget, he plays all the time on Twitch. I hope he still does name, I think he still, but anyway. The Prince Joey gained 23 experience points. Jeez. It's tough. Pokemon hide in the grass. Who knows when they'll pop out. Eh, pop out. Yeah, I'm gonna be doing this whole game, like walk close to the wall and get constant attack, because I want to level up. So if you hit battles, was then obviously you're playing the wrong series, I must not let it go. Go hop up. Go, Prince Joey. I really hope I don't die in this game, because... Because in every Pokemon game, if you die, you lose half your money, and in this game especially, it's hard to get money. There's only like a certain amount of items, there's no like special areas where you can like no way to keep one battles and get points and buy items like uh, HP up and PP up and you sell them for like 4,900 Poké, you can't do that in this game. Well, I think you can after the credits, but oh Joey, you must you. Frankly, Hop Up's like a bloody useless in this game. Oh, it's just splashing. Joey! Come on, Joe, have them. All we do is splash, this is ridiculous. But nothing happens. Oh. So, if we, if we can get Joey to raise me high level before we fight Digger on the first gym. Let's probably level him up now. Yay! So on that uh, end, then Joey going up level 6 from level 5, same day on the episode 3, so thanks for watching, enjoy me next time where me and my son Nicole have moved on.